hello guys welcome back to my channel so the last update about twist of fate rambo abandoned ria on the road after they had an argument and he followed Prachi. then ria went to the doctor in order to get a fake pregnancy tummy so that she can prove to everyone that she is truly pregnant and her tummy is coming out then prachi was also at the hospital with shahana and sedat because alia injured sedat and they took him to the hospital so we probably get to see Ria where she went to ask for fake Tommy. Let's continue. Please keep watching. Wendy and Grandma are in the room. Wendy asks Grandma that why is she worried? Grandma says she is in tension because Wendy is leaving. She says, how will I fight with Aliyah and Ria all alone? Wendy says, send Aliyah and Ria away from here. Then there will be no problem between Rambro and Prachi. Palavi clap hearing Grandma and Wendy's conversation. And she asks if it was Ria who asked Prachi to stay with Sidat in Bangalore Hotel. And then she asks Prachi to call Sidat baby as Rambu's baby. Palavi says to Wendy that you are older than me. And she asks her to be careful next time. Wendy tells Palavi that if you have taken care of everything before, then I wouldn't have said this. She says whatever is happening in this house is because of you. Wendy says she did not hold Prachi's hand when she was leaving the house. And you add your egos and instead. Palavi tells Wendy that she have a flight to catch, so she should leave. Prachi comes to Dr. Madurima's office. Dr. Madurima asks if Prachi have an appointment with her. Prachi says someone needs urgent medical help. Ria eyes her face hearing Prachi and says if Prachi comes to know about Dr. Madurima being my friend, then Prachi will find out about my fake pregnancy. Prachi tells Dr. Madurima that her friend is having injury. Ria thinks why she is scared. Dr. Madurima says she is a gynecologist. Prachi says sorry and she goes. Ria tells Dr. Madurima that she is Prachi, a real sister who snatched Rambro from her. Rambro comes to the office and tells Arian that Prachi is annoying him. Arian asks Rambro to decide about whom he would badmouth, else he will call him bad brother-in-law. Rambro says you are my brother and says Ria and Prachi are trouble. Rambo says Ria is on court trouble and Prachi is love trouble. Arian gets Shahana's call. Rambo says you are in love with Shahana. Arian says no. Rambo picks the call and says I love you Shahana pretending that he is Arian. Shahana says how dare you and she gets angry. Shahana tells Prachi that if she get jailed, then she should tell everyone in court that Arian had provoked her to murder him. She asks how dare you. I will write a story. Rambo asks her to calm down and asks her to relax because he was the one that said I love you to her. Shahana tells Rambo that because of his action, Arian would have gotten killed and I would have gotten charged for murder. She says she called Arian to know about Dr. Mahotra and says she is with Prachi. Rambo leaves hearing her. Arian takes the call and says Dr. Mahotra will connect with you. Shahana asks Aria not to give the phone to Rambro. Dr. Madurima asks if Prachi is Ria's friend. Ria says yes and says Prachi is her twin sister. She takes the fake stomach and she wears it. Ria gets shocked with how big her stomach is and she asks the doctor that what did you give me? I want a small stomach, not something this big. Dr. Madurima goes to get small fake stomach. Ria calls Alia, but Alia is busy so she did not pick the call. Rambro comes to the hospital and says his wife is in the hospital. The receptionist asks Rambro about the doctor's name that his wife had come to. Rambro says he doesn't know. He says that his wife is pregnant. The receptionist says your wife went to Dr. Madurima. Rambro goes. Arian comes to the hospital to inform Rambro that Prachi had come to the general physician for Sedat. He asks the receptionist and thinks if his friend has become a gynecologist. Rambro goes to the second floor mistakenly and he sees Prachi there. Rambro asks that what is Prachi doing here? Prachi says she came here for work. Rambro says that he heard Shahana saying that they are at the hospital, so he came here. Shahana says they have come to Dr. Mahotra. The receptionist tells Rambro that his wife is on the first floor and says her name is Ria. Prachi says okay. Shahana asks Prachi to go and clear all the doubt about Ria. Rambro asks Shahana that what are they talking about. Prachi says they should go and see Ria if she has any problem. She asks Rambro to come. Ria tells the doctor that all the fake stomach are not fitting her. 
Dr. Madurima mockingly tells Ria that the fake pregnancy tummy is not sweater, that it would fit her. Ria doubts the doctor, and she asks if the doctor is working with her sister. Dr. Madurima is shocked. Ria says Prachi might have offered much money to you, and Ria then warns the doctor not to dare do this and support Prachi against her. Dr. Madurima asks Ria that I am hiding your secret and supporting your lies, and you are doubting me. Outside, Rambo says Ria must be with the doctor. Prachi worries that what is Ria doing? She holds Rambo's hand. Rambo says I will complain about you. Rambo complains to the nurse that Prachi is holding his hand. The nurse says let her hold your hand and says she must be checking your nerves. Prachi says we should go and ask Ria's doctor if she is fine. Ria asks Dr. Madurima that what did you do for me that I should thank you and says you are getting money for that. Dr. Madurima asks Ria to go and says you made our friendship as transaction. She threatens to expose Ria's secret to her family. Ria asks the doctor what she will tell her family and she shouts. Rambro asks what is happening here. Ria gets shocked seeing Rambro. Arian is thinking of what to do because he is scared of Rambro. He collides with Shahana. Shahana and Arian confront each other for colliding with each other. Shahana asks Arian to say sorry. Arian asks Shahana why she made him say sorry. Shahana says I had to twist my finger to make you say sorry. Arian collides with the girl and says sorry. She also says sorry to him. Arian smiles and says bye to the girl. Shahana says that is why I am angry with his cheap behavior. Arian asks Shahana why she is jealous. Shahana says this is irritation jealous. Arian says I thought you would thank me, but you did not thank me. Disgraceful. Shahana says I know how to behave with such people like you. Arian says double standard girl. Shahana asks what did you say? Arian says nothing. Sida says, I heard what you said, Arian, and he asks him to talk to girls with respect. Arian says, first tell me how to talk to people like you, and says, I don't think you are a human. Shahana says, it is enough. Arian says, Sida did not think of anyone, but he thought about just himself. Arian tells Sida that you are calling my action wrong, even though you've done worse in Rambro and Prachi's relationship. Sida says, enough. Arian says, my sister's home is getting ruined. He says you don't have any sister, but you are just a stepsister. Shahana says that she will not be quiet now, and she tells Arian that Sidat is doing so much for his stepsister. Shahana tells Arian that Alia and Ria had kidnapped Sidat's sister, and they threaten Sidat to call Prachi's baby as his baby. She says if Sidat doesn't do this, then they will get Meika killed. Ria, Rambro, and Prachi comes there and they hear Shahana. Ria shouted no. She threatens Sidat and says, you have exposed me. I will ruin your life. She makes a call and asks the goon to kill Meika. Shahana says, it is my fault. I shouldn't have done this. It turns out to be Shahana's imagination. Rambro asks the doctor and Ria what they were about to expose. Prachi says, the doctor might want to tell us that Ria doesn't want her baby. And she thinks that I will not let Ria do this. She asks the doctor to say it. The doctor says I was telling Ria that she had some complications in her pregnancy. Prachi asks the doctor that what does she mean? The doctor says first I will get the test done and then I can know the complications that Ria has in her pregnancy. The doctor says why would I give everyone stress without confirmation? The doctor asks Ria to come for the checkup. Ria goes with Dr. Madurima. Rambo asks Prachi why is she stressed and she goes to get water for her. Prachi sees the message on Ria's phone and she notes down the number. Rambo brings water and makes Prachi drink it. Shahana asks Arian that what did you say? Arian says you said sorry. Shahana says to Arian that you were passing smile seeing the girls around. Shahana and Arian begins to fight again. Sida says stop it Shahana calling her as friend and he asks her to let them go. Arian says to Sida that Shahana is not your friend, so don't call her your friend. Shahana says Sidat is my friend. Arian says I will slap you, and he asks her to stay away from Sidat. Arian says Sidat is worse than the snake. Shahana says if I say that all the drama is created by your mother, then will you stop talking to her? Arian asks, what do you mean? Inside, Ria thanks Dr. Madurima and Oksa. She says, see how I was talking to you. And you have showed that your art is so good. I did not show you humanity, 
but he showed me friendship. Dr. Madrima shows the fake Tommy to Ria. Ria doubts the doctor again and says, My mind is doubtful, but my heart is truthful. Dr. Madrima asks Ria if this is how she talks to people. Ria says, I talk to people nicely, but I am very skeptical. The doctor says that she will give Ria the fake stomach and she asks her to manage it till tomorrow. Outside, Rambo asks Prachi if she was repenting to smile. Prachi recalls noting down the massage spa number on Ria's phone and Prachi answers Rambo that no. Rambo says to Prachi that you have fumbled while saying no and that is why I understood. Rambo asks Prachi that how many sweets have you stolen from the hospital's complimentary table. Prachi says five. Rambo says I will steal ten and Rambo takes some sweets. Dr. Madurima comes to Rambo and asks him to take care of Ria being her husband. Rambo says I will keep her away from stress and he goes. Ria smiles at Dr. Madurima and she goes. Arian asks Shahana what his mother has done. He says answer me. What has my mother done which I don't know? Shahana says to Arian that okay listen. Siddharth asks Shahana not to fight with Arian and he gets up from the chair. Shahana makes Siddharth sit down on the wheelchair again. Arian and Shahana argue again. Rambo and Prachi comes there and asks that what happened. Arian says I will go. Ria comes there and says that the doctor asks Rambo to take care of her because her pregnancy is complicated. Ria asks Siddharth what happened to him. Shahana says we have come here for Siddharth. Siddharth asks Shahana to take him away from there. Shahana takes Siddharth away from there on the wheelchair. Rambo also leaves. Prachi calls the spa number and lies that she is Ria's assistant and she asks if the timings have changed for Ria's massage. The lady on the call tells Prachi that the timings are the same. Prachi asks the spa lady about Alia Kana's spa appointment. The lady says that they have just one spa booking on Ria's name and she booked for deep tissue massage so Alia did not book for any spa session. Prachi thanks the lady and she ends the call. Rambo sits in the car and he keeps the water bottle at the back seat, thinking that Prachi will come there and sit with him in the car. Ria comes there and sits in the car where Rambo had prepared for Prachi. Ria says that she is very happy that Rambo came running for her in the hospital. Rambo tried to explain that he did not come to the hospital for Ria, but Ria keeps on talking, saying that she feels good and peace seeing Rambo taking care of her. Ria says, I know that you are repenting for your behavior and says you did not need to say anything and says she can feel is sorry. Ria says that today, she remembered the college Rambro and says she feels lost in those thoughts. Rambro get down from the car and he calls Prachi. Prachi asks, what is it? Rambro calls Arian and asks him to drive his car because he is not feeling okay. Arian asks Rambro that who would drive his own car. Rambo says I will call the driver to drive it. Prachi whispers to Shahana that she wants to tell her something that she found out about Ria, but she will tell her when they leave from there. Shahana and Seda sit in Rambo's car while Ria is sitting at the front. Rambo asks Prachi to come to Arian's car and he will drive her home. Prachi asks that if Rambo wanted to drive, then why did Rambo ask Arian to drive his car? Rambo says that he is happy to become Prachi's driver, so he will take her home. Ria gets angry after she realized that Rambo intentionally left his car because she was in the car and Prachi was not there. Shana gets down from Rambo's car and she goes with Rambo and Prachi. Rambo is driving the car and Prachi begins to think of how she called the spa and how they confirmed that Ria actually booked for a deep tissue massage, then how Ria asks Priya for papaya, then Prachi thinks that something is fishy. Arian is driving the car and Ria and Siddharth are also in the car. Ria gets more upset. She gets a call from the spa and the lady asks that when is Ria coming for the massage. Ria says that she cannot come today and says she did not confirm the appointment. The spa lady tells Ria that her assistant had called and she confirmed her appointment for today. Ria is shocked and she thinks that who is her assistant that confirmed her spa appointment. Okay guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Please don't forget to like the video, share it, and I'll see you all again in my next video. Thank you.